Hey guys, Havasu Lou out in beautiful Lake Havasu. Hey, we're out here checking out this newly listed four bedroom RV garage pool home for a client. Hang out, check it out too, and I'll talk to you in a minute. All right guys, we're out at 3742 Challenger Drive. This was just listed a few days ago for 989.9 sits on a huge 15 and a half thousand square foot lot this is a four bedroom so it has a casita you have a gated side access for rv boat parking goes all the way back all super easy yard maintenance and landscaping has a nice front Little entry courtyard, eight foot steel door. All right guys, this is a four bedroom, three bath pool home built in 2011, just over 2000 square feet at 203. Again, this was just listed this week for 989.9 sits on that huge 15,594 square foot lot. Nice eight foot interior doors, stack stone fireplace. Nice granite top kitchen island with some pendant lights, stainless appliances, pantry, glass tile backsplash, under cabinet and over cabinet lighting. All the cabinets are upgraded with the soft touch close. You do have reverse osmosis drinking water at your sink and a killer pool view out of your kitchen window. So this is a split floor plan with the master on one side of the house and the other guest bedrooms on the other side of the house. So this is your master suite. It's a pretty good size, has a door out to the backyard pool area and a little doggy door. So again, all the interior doors are eight foot, four hinge doors. You have dual granite topped sinks in the master bath, dual mirrors, can lights, a jetted tub. So you have a little linen closet and a cool walk-in tiled shower with two heads and jets. Nice size walk-in closet with some built-ins. Toilet also has its own door for privacy. Let's go check out the other side of the house. So you have your first guest bedroom, kind of in the middle of the house. It's a pretty good size actually for a guest bedroom. This lot is big, so they're able to get both the RV garage and the bigger room sizes. You have your guest bath in the middle of the hall. Tiled full tub shower combo. So you have another little linen closet in the hall and then the third uh, bedroom on the inside of the house. There's also a casita we'll go check out in a minute. So back on the other side of the house where the master lives, there's a, another linen closet. Your indoor laundry hookups. Same upgraded cabinets and your garage access. So you have a real nice uh, garage setup. Has an extra deep two car side that's 29 feet deep with eight foot insulated doors. Has a bunch of built-ins, integrated speakers. There's also air in here as well. This was used as a shop, so there's like 
a bunch of outlets and air everywhere. And then you also have a 68 foot RV garage with a 13 foot door. You have your water heater, soft water, reverse osmosis, all your home runs for cable and your irrigation system. You have your little utility sink. They had a hoist in here at one time and you can still see that part up there. And don't forget about the urinal. Gotta have that in your shop. So it has a drive-through bay as well that also looks to be 13 feet high. Tons of built-in storage. So let's go check out the casita and the pool area. All right, so off the kitchen back door slider, you have a covered patio and access to the casita to your left, another eight foot door. This is just a standard like master suite style casita, so there's no like kitchenette or anything. You also have a bathroom and walk-in closet in here. All right, let's check out the pool. I also have a real nice backyard pool shot out the window. So the place has a killer, killer backyard pool setup, all travertine decking blown out all the way. Under the patio, there's also some artificial turf. Really, really nice. So you also have a super cool covered gazebo type setup, stack stone, speakers in the ceiling, can lights, full bar with a beer fridge, barbecue, sink, green egg style setup with concrete tops. There's also a space heater in the corner there. I don't know if you can see that. So here's another shot of your gated side uh, RV boat parking that goes all the way back to the wall. This place is fully walled. There is room for another RV garage or even another like building if you wanted to put a couple more bedrooms or something. Cool little seating area. Pool is awesome. All Pebble Tech. Little sit at area off the Baja shelf. Also has a water slide and grotto with a table inside. Let me see if I can. Real nice setup for sure. Yeah, so there's tons and tons of room back here to add another RV garage and more, for sure. Here's the back shot of the waterfall and grotto. This pool is heated. Alright guys, have a see Lou back again with you. Hope you enjoyed the quick little video walk through the house over here on Challenger. Again, this one was just listed for $989.9. I will put a direct link to the listing detail page right below this video. So you guys get all the original listing pictures, current price, and availability. Of course, if you guys have any questions at all, always feel free to reach out to me. All my contact information is right below this video. You guys have a great day and I'll talk to you soon.